Yeah. So, okay. So anyways, yeah, you know, I'm sitting around this morning and, uh, you know, by the way, these guys, these motherfuckers think that, you know, they don't have people in their camps that are literally already turning on them and, you know, sending me all sorts of info and all this shit. So I'm getting some pretty spicy tea this morning from a very, you know, pretty reliable source here. I'm not going to name them, of course, but they, they, they sent me some info and, and I start looking into this. I'm like, holy shit. I think, like, you know, this checks out for me. So basically, one sec. got a yep. conquest 91 cent, $10 guys, guys, I have the funniest joke that is completely original is in no way tired and guaranteed to get the lols. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> okay, here it goes. <laughs> Ralph is fat. By the, <laughs> by the way, they're fat guys way fatter than me. <laughs> me. <laughs> uh, all right, one more, go ahead. Extremely online nigger sent three dollars. Metakika is literally giving you personal trainer levels of motivation he to is. lose weight. Yeah. I also follow a lot of the anti AF slash Ralph Telegram channels, and I'm gonna have to leave them cause they keep posting actual gay shit to own Nick. Self own master. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Let's send gay porn to own yeah. Nick. Yeah. Oh, dude. Thanks. Anyway, go ahead, sir. Okay. So, so, so yeah. So I'm sitting there. I guess sent a bunch of intel. So basically, if you guys don't know, this VHS archive is a literal mentally ill tranny. Like, we already assumed what the? You know, it's some weird, yeah, fucking person. But now we literally know it is an actual fucking tranny. It is a dude dressing as a girl, cross-dresser. Mm. I don't fucking know, bro. And, and we'll get mm. to that later. But, I mean... <laughs> These people don't have a great track record, you know. People fucking their sisters, <sighs> fucking faggots, fucking dudes off grinder, antifa trannies, you know. It, it, this is pathetic, and and you you could have already known this because if you go look at this person's timeline, you know, it's still on Twitter. Uh, I think their main YouTube got possibly taken down or some shit. Um, but good, you know, good. Boy, well, yeah, as I say, good, yeah. Uh, but I was looking for it too. They used to have a few thousand subs though, and they would post stuff like um, clips from my show or whatever, trying to fuck with me, or clips from IP2. Uh, and they're yeah. on Twitter all the time, you know, basically advocating for Baked Alaska to be put in prison, yeah, uh, oh, yeah. and not just in like you know some of these faggots, whatever. I don't even know. They're just talking shit oh, or whatever. Yeah, well, but it's, but it's it's, it's more about yeah, it's not just you, you know, it's they a were, different they way. Were actually came after Wooza, they yeah, were trying to get him locked up for like. I don't know, some, just the dumbest shit, literally lying and like, you know, sending shit to law enforcement and, yeah. you know, uh, posting shit about mm. our, our legal issues and all. And it's like, look, like, you're totally right, Ralph. It's like, there's one, you know, it's one thing to be like, sure. oh, you know, these guys are funny, right. fuck them, whatever. No, this whole account is dedicated to like trying to put us in jail, trying to ruin our lives, trying to like, and it's clearly, it's a get, who is it against? It's against right-wingers. And you can look at their timeline right now. They're promoting left-wing scumbag journos like Ben Smith, the CEO or, you know, former CEO of BuzzFeed News, et cetera. They're propping up left-wing people. And, and, and well, look how they, you know, talk about us. Well, and Jim, Big Alaska GNA putting my full name, docs. They were doxing you in Portugal. They were helping coordinate, you know, COG do that assault on you. And so it's like... What the fuck is going on here? Dude, they're on a you different know? level. It, it, it's a different yeah. level. And, and you know, like you said, they're using your full name. They're they're active, actively only talking about really stuff like January 6th or, yeah. or right wing or, or let's promote Ben Smith. There's like a very specific bent to what they're saying. Like we just looked at their new new channel uh, and I'll pull it up here. Uh, uh, it was, it's already pulled up in my other window, but it's like attack on Nick, attack on Nick, gun hunt, Portugal, baked in desk destiny, yeah. January 6th discussion, which they were trying to promote as something like that could get yeah. you in trouble basically. And that's why they put oh, yeah. that on there. Ethan Ralph meltdown on Chrissy Mayer. Like it's, it's just all like that type of shit. You know what I mean? Like some people are just talking, you know, fuck this fat ass Ralph or whatever. Yeah. Like, and again, they're faggots too, but it's just a different, it's a different bit versus oh i'm trying to get this guy beat down in a foreign country i'm trying right. to get baked alaska put in jail like you know what i mean like these I, are different yeah no yeah. no it's, it's it's fucked up and like and, and that's a funny thing too like it's so ironic these people you know want to come out here and go oh my gosh you know you guys you know someone flagged a fucking video get fucked like like go look at this fucking mentally ill tranny's timeline 
every single fucking thing is about me or you or Nick or Wooza or Lowell's or, you know, someone in our, in the America first sphere. Right. And it's just like coping and seething and like, Oh my gosh. So <laughs> anyway, so, so, you know, we, we figured, okay, this, this is some, you know, fucking nut job. These, these guys don't have a great track record over here. And then some, you know, hats off to this fucking autist, some fucking autist on probably 4chan or whatever made this chart and docks this motherfucker. And yeah, so j- just, you know, how the rabbit trail goes. Now let that, me show it by the way, yeah, um, because this person, I was familiar, I was familiar with their channel because um, they've been around for a while. Uh, well, for a couple <laughs> of years, I guess. Um, and they've been posting negative shit about me. Now it's not because I don't just follow it all the time. I look at faggot farms because I know that's there every day. Right? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it's like every day they're making us some shit about me. So I'll look at that a little bit more, but like, okay, it might take a while for a negative YouTube channel f- to pop up, but I saw them. I knew they were a fag and it's like, okay, VHS oh, archive. Man. Sorry to cut you off, but sure, this is no someone song. who's, literally actively promoted by medicare that's right oh yeah many times and it's not just him other people it's not just him but but he was very actively promoted by medicare that's right um and and many other people vhs archive has been making a lot of um hit pieces on me and you and and nick and just everybody honestly um why and and, sorry point out a single fucking left-wing person this motherfucker has gone after because they, you know, they want to talk about lol cows, right? They want to talk about, Oh, these people are so funny. You know, didn't uh, Ethan Klein from H three just uh, threatened to bomb the NRA a few days ago. He did. Yeah. You know, didn't, didn't, you know, all, all, all these people, all these left wing fags, you know, Hassan Piker are doing crazy shit day in and day out. But they only want to focus on the right wing people, the right wing di- dissidents that are censored everywhere. Hmm, it's almost as if there's an agenda here, and, and like this is not well, a fucking conspiracy anymore. And, and so, and, and so, I was looking at the thing, and, and I was like, well, okay, well, what's the tie yeah. here? And so, you look at the the email here on VHS Archives hmm. account. Now, the email yep. is lunabucks at gmail dot com. Mm-hmm. This is an email they publicly listed on their own channel. <laughs> yeah. There's archive links to this. Like this is not like this is this is locked down. Yeah. First off, that's a very strange name. Um, it's not something that you, that you would just. I mean, I don't know. I've never heard of that before. Like that doesn't ring a bell to me. I don't think it's a popular character or anything that I know of. Maybe it is. I don't know. Um, but it's it's very strange to have that uh, as your email address. Would you agree with that? Yeah, yeah, no, it's definitely like you know a feminine name there, and uh, uh, yeah, well, I well, I mean, it's just Luna Bucks is a very um, specific like name, right? Like I, I don't know what to say. Yeah, uh, yeah. and then so you, that email can lead to a lot of different places, uh, and you see. Wow, it just fits all the way around. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> so you see a Twitter account pop up. Let me pull this up. And ordinarily, I'd be able to show Bakes at the same time, but I'm just going to do it this way because it's a little bit easier. Oh, yeah, that's fine. You, you see this, and I'll pull him back up here in a minute. Uh, but you see this, Big Tech's with us as well. Shout out Big Tech. Now you see this. This links to this Twitter account. Uh, Luna Bucks, computer engineer, student, music producer, audio engineer in training. <laughs> Links to a, a fucking literal Tumblr blog, by the way. My Little Pony? Uh, yeah, it does appear to be a My Little Pony. <laughs> You're right, actually. I didn't even notice that. Oh, shoot. <laughs> You're right. That is a, that is a pony there. Yeah. Brony. Uh, you know how many bronies have turned trench? Do you know, Moff, actually, um, it's well known, so it's not a secret, but the ex-boyfriend of, of my fucking woman actually turned tranny. And, what? Yeah, and he was oh. a brony. Um, so <laughs> yeah. I think this is wow. like a common thing in their community to just turn yeah. into trannies. Now, of course, he lost his woman after that because, you know. Yeah. Um, but uh, now let's see. So you look into that and you're like, well, not bucks. What the fuck? <laughs> so that leads you to that leads you to a, a YouTube channel. 
Right. And, uh, and you know, uh, the funny thing about this, a good way to get yourself doxxed or to get like fucked up shit linked back on you, especially for a normie. For me, it's like whatever. Um, everybody knows who I am. It is what it is. But for a lot of normies or like regular people who decide to get involved in this all of a sudden, um, there's a lot of uh, Google accounts just laying around um, oh, yeah. that you had to make to log on to YouTube or whatever. And you just decided to use whatever email you had. And, oh, there's the pony again. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Pony. That's right. <laughs> and um, so a lot of times fucked up shit ends up happening and you get docs because of that. Uh, and yeah, so- you can literally like search that yeah. email that they put on their um, on their YouTube channel and That's that'll right. show you. Yeah different accounts they registered with like yeah. what a fucking retard it's, it's really bad uh <laughs> it's really bad for these people now and now here goes the youtube channel so it's like okay youtube channel mm-hmm. now that's not the only account though that was found mm. like, there was a there was an instagram account and it actually has a link back to the youtube account in the Instagram account, which is like, oh no, that's not good. <laughs> and so then you then you pull up this. Hold on, let me let me. Uh, fuck, I have it right here. I just copied the wrong thing. Yeah, here we go. Okay, let me pull this up. Then you pull up the. Oh no. You pull <laughs> up the is, Instagram. This is where it gets bad. This Parental is where it's starting to get a little bad. All right, now. Oh, discretion let me advise. Z- let me zoom in a little bit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Kitty gets claws. Hold on, can we see this? Oh no! Boomer playing with cheap nail art, buying the cheapest on AliExpress. No sponsors or promo links. Pay for with my oh. own money. Oh no! Oh, there it is. Luna the bucks. Luna bucks. Oh god! What is it? Ah. Oh. Thanks. No, no. No, no. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit, that looks scary. How old is he, she, whatever? Like, I see the fucking wrinkles on the fucking forehead. Like, that, that's uh, got to be in the 40s. It looks like Dusty Rhodes. I don't know if you've ever seen him where he used to, like, <laughs> do the blade job. Like, <laughs> he wouldn't even make that like a sticker. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're right. If we I'm have the master running. stickers here, can we get a sticker of this fucking nasty <laughs> fuck? Uh... <laughs> oh no! I mean, like, what are the what are the chances? It's like these fucking people, like they, oh they end God. up being fucking trannies and faggots, and they're oh, fucking dude. dudes. They're fucking their sisters. These are the people that hate us twenty four seven. Holy fucking shit. Dude, Dalton, can I say this shit on air? I just got sent something live. Oh, my God. Do it. Oh, I can't. He said don't show it. Oh, okay. Don't show it. Don't show it. Fuck. Oh. Dude, you wouldn't even believe. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, my God. Okay. We got to bring Dalton on here. We can't. Yeah, if he wants, I'll send him the link. Oh, all right. Dude, this I'll is. I'll send it to his uh, Telegram. Now, this guy's a little bit more of a bit player, I guess. Yeah, it's a kiwi fag. Oh, dude. But still. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. He's kind of got a big following, though, when I look at that. Ah. Uh, let's see. Oh. oh, no. This is not good for that guy. I want to be a little. I like. I have. Like, I, I'm seeing what I'm seeing. <clears throat> but I want to be careful because uh, <laughs> I don't want them to be able to to cover any tracks. Let me uh let me send him the link though. Oh wow. Luna Buck sent three dollars. Jim you <laughs> took her groomed me when I was fifteen. Oh man. Jim, you motherfucker. Oh, Luna Bucks. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think about all this? VHS archive, Luna Bucks. Let me let me pull this up. Oh. Sexy, they said. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they got this, that whole, like, you know, when you got a, I've seen this, like when you got an eye right here, but there's no definition. And so your eyelid is like morphed into your turbo grow. I percent $3. It's called. We do a little investigating smile. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, like, this is something I want. Like, you know, all the viewers to understand is like these motherfuckers are playing around in the mud all day. 
They're fucking in the piranha tank. They're on fucking faggot farms, fan fiction farm, whatever, you know, they're rolling around with Medicare and all, you know, chemo casino. They really think that their info is not going to get out there when that's what they live and fucking breathe all day. Like they're all going to, they're all turning on each other already. Like what the fuck? Like, like we give a flying fuck that their information is getting put out there. Plus, the, I don't give a fuck. Plus, the thing is, they don't. I mean, some of them might understand it, but most of them don't. So the big push from the fag squad, um, the millennial segment of of all the viewers, you know, that watch all these shows, was mm-hmm. you know, come to tech blah, 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 and all this shit. Well. Anonymous no, sent three dollars no, this no, no, no. Sunset no, 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 that's my address. Oh, okay. doc- see, okay. hey, wow, yeah, well, really, already out there. No, shit, they're doxing you. Yeah. That's how yeah, mad they are right now. Holy, fuck, dude. Exactly, exactly. yeah, yeah. Let, let, let me say this if this Holy wasn't shit. real. Why the fuck they would be I doing that? Probably gonna, they're probably gonna swap me right now, too. I that's wouldn't, what they do when they get pissed. I wouldn't be surprised, you know? by the way. The yeah. Instagram account was deleted yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. since all this has yeah. happened. If, um, yeah, if you look up that Instagram, I'm not sure when, but I looked this morning af- after I was sent that information, that Instagram is gone. Well, see, and, and that, that's the other thing. If it was, you know, because that VHS archives on Twitter is live tweeting this, coping, saying, oh, that's not me. Sure. No, no, no. Okay, so why was the Instagram? Well, but look, it's not even a, it's not even about the Instagram getting deleted. That's just one more. You linked the the email. Why did you have the email on there? Three dollars. I'm starting to think when they call me Toker Daddy Jim, they're being sincere and sexually turned on and not ironic. Well, Jim they has are. a harem of MTF trannies confirmed. I think you're right. But but why did you have the email on there? What can they explain that with? Three dollars plot twist. Luna Bucks is Metroker's <laughs> actual doc. <laughs> like, I mean, okay, if that if you're big okay, so you're saying we're wrong. First off, you linked that fucking email. Nobody else did that. And it's some weirdo yeah. looking tranny. Like, I don't know, you fucking did that. Like I, I didn't do that. How did that well, email and, get there? Who the fuck like, picks Luna Bucks? And, at, and let's like look at recent history. Look at how they responded. To Tuck's getting exposed. Were they oh, saying, up, oh, you guys were right, you know, fuck you fuck this guy? No, they didn't. Oh. They did covering. everything they could to cover for that guy. And only yep. now are they starting to throw him on the bus. I guess somebody brought him up. Um I didn't watch it. I only saw it on Faggot Farms while they were oh. lying about me. They were trying to cover for Tucks for like two or three days, by the way. And oh, yeah. then uh, Jim last night, even though he's too lazy to do his own fucking stream, the night before he called into somebody's show, and I guess Tux was in the audience, and he was like, hey, can I come on and say goodbye to Daddy Jim? I'm about to leave the internet. I'm about to leave the internet. First off, a sick fuck like that is never going to leave the internet. Oh, yeah, but, and, and you like how uh, Medicare has just been you know, mysteriously sick for the last week. Ah, uh, no. You notice that. Dude, you notice oh, ever man. since the tux, tux news, the cancer yeah. got a lot worse. Yeah. The cancer got a lot worse. Baked. It got really bad. Yeah. Holy yeah. shit, it got bad. Oh, I noticed that too. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, it wasn't working. Oh, I'm feeling ill. Um, but yeah, so Tux, anyway, uh, Tux was asking, could he, could he call in? And, um... Medic Medicare was like, oh, what do you mean the guy fucked it? What the guy fucked his sister? Or, you know, I heard that or whatever. Oh no, fuck that guy. He's a faggot. Um, and it was just pathetic because people have been talking about it. Oh wait, what's this? Is that a link to a lean a new Luna Bucks or a different Luna Bucks? Hold on, I'll look. Uh, or I mean the same Luna Bucks. Luna Bucks. What in the yeah. fuck is even with that name? Script goes deep. Luna, but oh no, it's a different one. Oh wait, it's a oh, but no, it's the same. But it still yeah. says freelance musician. No, nah, I don't know if that's the same person though. It says freelance musician, music producer though. Actually, so I don't know. I don't know if that one. What, is well, linked we gotta not. remember the that there that was our covered anyway. Kitty Claus was a personal account. That had that um, YouTube linked in there. We have yeah. The, the, well, that's the important part. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and, and archive that though in case because they did mm. say something about um, 
I don't remember if it was music student or what, but it was computer something. So I'm going to archive that just in case. I mean, you know, they could just make another account too or, or have like some side well, clearly they have there. multiple accounts. Yeah, too. yeah, that's right, exactly. So I was like, <laughs> okay, I'm just going to hit the archive button on that one just in case. Um, okay, so now I'm looking through here. Uh, but yeah, they were they were definitely trying to run cover for this guy, and now finally they're saying, "Oh yeah, fuck him or whatever." And we have a whole. I might just turn that on here in a minute. Uh, <laughs> the the Tux Cope session with Plate Gang uh, since our last stream. And by the way, I don't know if you know this. I don't think you do. There's a lot more to come on the Tux story. He was in oh, all yeah. these discords. Uh, oh, man, I just don't know what I can say publicly. I just don't want them to be able to cover their tracks or to yeah. be able to effectively uh, rebut it before I put it out there. So I'm just like trying to pull my punches a little bit. Let's just say that a lot of people knew a lot of what was going on, and there's some stuff that people don't even know about. Uh, Tux was kind of a celebrated faggot, basically, uh, in all these Discord servers. He had unfettered access to miners, uh, and it was known that he was talking to everybody on the sun, including miners. Uh, and so, again... We'll be talking about this really soon. Uh, maybe even before I leave Madrid, I might do a show on that on Saturday. We'll see. Um, How can the Tuck story even get worse, dude? Well, like, what the fuck? Well, because you're right, though. I mean, honestly, you're right. <laughs> Fucking your sister and all that coming out. But oh. it's like, yeah, it can get worse, and it's about to get worse oh, because sure. <laughs> um, he was in all these circles, and it was known what a sick faggot he was the whole time. Uh, mm. And only when it became a problem, only when he became expendable, basically. Did they make a move on this guy? If he wanted some credit with me, he could just come out and spill everything he has uh, on all these fuckers. I mean, he's still a sister fucker. He can't get that back. But bring him on. <laughs> <laughs> he can't get that part back. Uh, but yeah. I'd give him a little. I'd give him just a little slight uh, speck of respect if he if he would come out and dump it all because um, these guys are. They knew what was going on. <laughs> Maybe not about the sister, but he was also involved in some. Um, like I said, uh, sick shit uh, on these discords, and it was known too. Mm. Now let me, uh, yeah, now let me like this. Oh my god! Oh shit! How am I gonna? Uh, you want me to show it? Okay, okay. Oh, he's in the business. Oh shit, <laughs> dude! Am I just gonna show it now? Did he say you can show it. Uh, yeah, he did. It? Let's see. Anonymous source chimed in. I followed up with them and. They're just like, yeah, you can go ahead and talk about it. Oh, no. Kiwi Farms user Jockers, a.k.a. Charles Allen Jockers. Oh, no, this doesn't look good. <laughs> this doesn't look good, babe. Oh, no. I want to see it. I want to see it. I know you're about to. Oh, Hold on. And by, the, by the way, I mean, you know, I, I don't know how much longer we're going to talk about the VHS archive, but. Wait, one more. Uh, Donald archive. J. Trump sent $10. Donald J. Trump is calling for a complete and total shutdown of Discord until our country's representatives can figure out what the hell is going on. Uh, we have to. Donald J. Trump is calling for a total and complete shutdown of Muslims entering the United States until our country's representatives can figure out what the hell is going on. <laughs> I can't believe that he actually said that, but all right. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, I, I was just going to say that um, just, just, I don't know if you want to show that full chart that I sent you that some autism. Oh, that shows it. Yeah, I will show that. It actually. Shows, yeah, it shows that VHS's Kiwi Farms account is called Gay Stoner. And I remember Nick actually mentioned that account. Sorry. Um, it's, 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 it's so fucking obsessive. It's like, it's a literal full time job, like for the ADL sure. or shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I, let me show I, the full chart. Believing that's not someone on a fucking payroll. Well, I mean, because why would you even be that dedicated? Like, I'm not dedicated. That get dedicated to my hobbies. Like, what the fuck? Um, yeah. All right, now let me see. Yeah, I will show yeah, that. Yeah, the, chat, the chat, the chat knows who that is. They're saying, oh, that's gay story. Yes. Yeah, yeah, it's the same yeah, one. Same person. We've linked all the accounts together. Yeah, it's it's the same one for sure. By the way, there was a massive um, leak of Kiwi Farms users' emails uh, oh, a year beautiful. or so ago, right? Like, so we it's might, like we have to check that out. Yeah, we might have to double cross with that or double check with that. Let's see, um, just to get even more confirmation. Let me um, put this up on uh, Imager. Come on, Imager. Thank you, Donald Trump, for that. By the way. 
Uh, how in the fuck? Okay, there it is. Yeah, that's the full one, I think. Okay. Sorry, I'm uploading this as we go here on our mobile mobile uh, sunrise episode. Uh, VHS archive, Luna Bucks, Kitty Gets Claws. Uh, <laughs> there's more Luna Bucks there. There's their Instagram. Gay stoner. Fucked up queer is what their profile says, by the way. Well, I don't really disagree with that, I don't think. Uh, let me see. Can they see that? I think I still have you on the screen. Let me pull this up. Yeah, it's on my screen. Okay. Uh, all right. I'll pull this up here. Fucked up queer. <laughs> wow, baked. And these are the people that, like, they're using sources from, you know, the, I mean, liter- what was it? Josh Moon literally was like, oh, yeah, the ADL reads our website and uses it as sources. You know, like, yeah, no <laughs> shit, dude. Like, yeah, we know that. We, we know. Yeah, there you go. Well, and Medicare, literally, this is not a joke. Dude, I can't even, honestly, I couldn't even believe he did this because he knew what I was about to do on this show, that I was about to come on and link him to left-wing faggots, and I was about to make that our my main story for the next day or two. And mm. he literally knew that, and he still came out and tweeted out the article from the SPLC. Like, Wow. I mean, he knew that was about to happen. I guess he just does not yeah. care. Yeah, they don't care. Like, I, I, you know, they don't care at this point. Like, like, look, he's literally linking. This is not a joke article. This is, I mean, you would think it is. Uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> from, you know, it's Michael Hayden and it's SPLC. But, no, actually, yeah. it's not. That's a yeah. real fucking article that they wrote and put out today. Did he just fucking put? Dude, what else can you say, Baked? Yeah. Like, I, I don't know. I, yeah, they, they, they. they they're praising, you know, these sources from the ADL, SPLC, Media Matters, you know, Juden, even on the show said, oh, yeah, you know, like, I'll take a yeah. paycheck from the ADL. Of course, you know, they're they're trying to play it off now as, oh, it's, ju- it's just jokes, you know, it's right, jokes, jokes, guys. Yeah. But it's like, why, you know, I people really need to just see the patterns here. They're constantly pumping up literal left-wing journals. So, you know, some of these guys are worse than the left-wing journals, you know, like, Nick Martin and Jared Holt literally said, you know, yeah, we don't like Nick, but you know, that tranny story is actually false. Yet these guys, chemo casino, Medicare are still running with the shit. Even when fucking Antifa shills are saying, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't know about this, you know? So that's the level of integrity. These guys have, they don't give a fuck about anything. You know, they grifted <laughs> off you know, right wing culture, they grifted off gamer gate or saying the N word or being edgy or, you know, red pilled content, whatever. Now it looks like, you know, the bucks have dried up. They're, you know, trying to get some money from the, you know, and they want to stay on YouTube. No better. Excuse me. I don't want to interrupt too much, but they, they want to stay on YouTube no matter what, babe. Oh yeah. Right, oh. like that's what they yeah, decided. They, they don't give a fuck. Yeah. Judas McClunafelter sent three dollars. Anybody looking for an X chromosome? Just found it. Extra. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Finish your thought. But I just wanted to say, like, a lot of it is tied to just wanting to stay on YouTube. Uh, if you look at Keemstar, this fag, I mean, he's went all in with me just being a fag. He tried to put you in prison. Yeah. Uh, and, and you and you see any any other dick suck thing. Oh, Ralph, cut yourself and I'll get you 100000 no, 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 which he's full of shit. But uh, I'm not doing that anyway, even if I thought you were for real. Uh, Medicare. Oh, fuck, I'm Mr. Me Too now. Let me promote trannies, anti for trannies. Like, these guys don't give a fuck. They want to stay on YouTube. You know what I want to see? YouTube out of business. I want to see Susan in fucking okay. chains. Lay, let down the fucking street on a goddamn fucking leash in chains. That's what I want to see from Susan Wojcicki. Yeah. Well, I mean, you know, last thing I'll say about it is like, yeah, I mean, just look at what they're doing. Look at, you know, what sources they're using. They're constantly using ADL, SPLC, Media Matters. Um, they're promoting left-wing uh, journo scum. Um, and like I said, a lot of the left-wing journos have even more integrity than them. And, you know, what are they doing? They're attacking, you know, Nick Fuentes. They're attacking a January 6th defendant like me. Look, and, and it's all in bad faith. And we've seen this time and time again. They said, oh, my gosh, you know, bake the Fed because, 
he's taking a plea deal. And then when I actually fight the feds in court and say, <laughs> you know, I think I'm innocent. I don't know about this plea deal. I feel like I'm being forced into it. Rikes then they still try to call you a fed. Do you guys yeah, see the ADL and SBLC potentially protecting all these guys from getting banned? Like how yes. there are no bans on their oh, side yes. of the aisle? <laughs> None at all. Well, Kiwi let me let me the exception due to extremism. Well, because the they're just insane. Yeah. Really sketch. Okay. Well, I'll wait. I'll wait. Get gold Go sent three dollars. Hashtag unmask my toker. Hashtag cancel Andy Race War. Let's go. Agree. I was supposed to say. All right, go ahead. <laughs> Hell yeah. Um, no, I I was gonna say you know someone was asking me. I did a Twitter space yesterday, um, and people were saying uh, they were like. Bake, why is, you know, Chemo Casino, like, how are they able to keep their YouTube channel? I was like, you know what? That's a really fucking good question. And I think more people need to look into that. I mean, what I can tell you from experience, I know Andy Worski has a YouTube manager. Um, I forget what it, what his name was, but I could probably find it in my emails or something. But Something Goldstein, gave, I think. Yeah, yeah. He, yeah, Goldstein somewhat. Like he, <laughs> he, so he gives a guy like 10% of his earnings. Uh, Nick one's calling. Hell yeah. I mean. Okay, but shit. yeah, send him the link uh, uh, if it's easier for you. Um, or I can send it on Signal. Um, yeah, if you could send okay. it. Okay, I can I send it on Signal. Yeah, Discord. I can do it on Signal. Um, okay, but I, I know this This is not a theory. This is like, you know, I've, I've literally talked to – uh, Andy's people before. So he gives a guy like 10% of his like, you know, ad revenue or 15%, whatever it is. And then this guy puts them on a network and essentially they have a uh, higher protection than a normal channel mm -hmm. because they sure. have an in with YouTube and they have a YouTube rep that says, you know, if they break TOS or something, they say, Oh, you know, can you clean this up or whatever? So, I mean, I believe, I don't know, you know, for certain, but I know Andy had that on all of his other um, channels. So I believe he probably, you know, hooked it up for PPP to do it on his channel since he's banned and got him the network protection with YouTube. And so they're playing ball over there. And, you know, their butt buddy Kim yep. Star is also connected with YouTube. Yep. Well, they're just selling out to stay. All they want to do is stay on YouTube, stay on Twitter. They don't Patriot give a fuck. Patriot Pro for 88 cent $3. I just took four Adderall. Three Xanax and Haven T taken my antipsychotics in three weeks. The shadow people are telling me to go to Jim's house. No. Can you help me find it? No. no, no. <laughs> this is a, unless you're hiring a private investigator and doing it legally. All right, now <laughs> uh, let me uh, send Nick that link. Uh, I got it set up to send, and I'll also get ready to tweet out another promo. And then I'm gonna let Bake talk for a minute because I'm gonna step away and use the bathroom. Hey, I'm here too. I just want to. Oh, yeah. Big Tech, what's up? Chilling and uh, I ain't said anything because I don't even know what to yeah, say. Yeah, weigh in now is a perfect oh, time. Just, get in there. I, I want to hear I what am, Big Tech has to say. Me like, too, actually. I got, no, I got nothing to say, dude. This is all. Just, <laughs> no, I find it so. Um, it's like repulsive and disgusting to me on a level where I feel. It's uncomfortable to even look at it. The more I discover about these people and the, mm -hmm. I, the way they behave, the comments that they make, their sick obsessions, it's just like I, – I, it reminds me of, you know, those to catch a predator type videos where you see they finally catch one. And yeah. we watched one, I don't know, a few months back where I'll a woman right. caught this big fat guy who had uh, molested a kid at summer camp and – she wasn't sitting there laughing about how, oh, ha, 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 we caught you. You're gay. You're a gay molester. Ha, ha, ha. I mean, I get it that it is funny. There is like a hilarious part to the irony of catching that these people who are harassing us turn out to be just weird, degenerate psychos. Mm -hmm. But to me, it also hits me on a level where I'm like, not angry, but I'm, I'm like, I, it, it makes me get, uh, I feel aggressive toward these people. Not, it's, it doesn't yeah. make me laugh. It makes me get like icy cold like these but are you like are you they, actually, they gotta go like are you actually surprised you know like is this like a big surprise that you know these i mean we already knew these people hate god you know they hate they literally mock you know the christ is king phrase they 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 hate christ they hate america first you know it's like yeah. we we know where these people come from i guess it is a little shocking to like you know, get the full confirmation and like see their right. Fucking That's what faces it is. It's like and they have the masks on, and the, you know they're gay and they're trannies. And I just think the craziest thing is that, like I said, the, you know, Medicare became known. He became famous off of GamerGate. So you would think, you know, he's 
you know, used to owning the SJWs and the blue haired freaks or whatever. But then when these, you know, tranny freaks serve his purpose, he's just going to turn a blind eye and pretend that, oh, these, you know, people aren't, don't even exist. And it's just not true. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a buzzkill comment for me to make, but I just got to say that's, that's the way I'm feeling. So maybe I'm representing a few in the audience too. It's just like, this is sick Uh and sad. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Lofa. Remember to like and subscribe.